Since the 17th century, the magic lantern has been made in all shapes and sizes. Also, various types of light source have been used, from the simple candle through various forms of oil burners, then gas and limelight, and finally to electricity. All photographers used the lantern to enlarge photographs. Various British manufacturers brought in new improved lanterns with very interesting names. This one wick paraffin lantern has been converted to electricity. This one has a circular wick and the large chimney creates more draft for a brighter light. This German lantern by Ernst Planck has a two parallel wick burner called the duplex in a Newtonian enclosure an improvement of the American Psyoptican. Subsequently, three and even four wick burners were produced. Gas started to be used, but was not very satisfactory and very dangerous, until the limelight was invented. Using a mixture of oxygen and hydrogen to heat a ball of lime, producing a very bright light. Electricity came next. First came the carbon arc, then the filament bulb. This is an Osram 250 watt black cap. and this a Philips 500 watt. I use this today. The newfangled movies came in at the turn of the century and dual machines came into use. But the story of the moving image is a story for another day. <laughs>